Good day, students, and welcome to today's episode of Doceri by me, Mr. Cogswell. Today's episode will focus on a reading strategy called close reading. This is an important reading strategy that helps you deal with rigorous or challenging text and build your reading muscles. Close reading is reading with a pencil. We are going to be annotating on text. So, close reading really involves three separate readings, so we can really get to know our text very well. In the first reading, we are just going to be digging into the surface of the text just a little bit to get an idea of the gist, the big picture. In the second read, we're going to dig a little bit deeper, and we are going to look at the details in the text so we can get a better understanding of what the text is about. And finally, in our third read, we're going to dig really deep, and we're going to find some evidence somewhere in the text to analyze, to look at closely, and then respond. So, let's go ahead and take a look at our first reading, which we shall call, that first reading, Phase 1. So this is our first reading. We're going to look at the gist. And the question we're going to ask is, read this with me, everybody. What is the big picture? We're going to take a look at the text and analyze it before we read, looking at text features to orient ourselves to the text. We are also going to read the text one time through to get an idea of the flow and what the topic of the text is. This is a gist, and it will give us an idea of the big picture. That's the first read. In the second read, we're digging a little bit deeper. We're breaking through the surface. So, that's going to be our second read, phase two. And in our second read, we're going to look at the details. We're going to ask ourselves, do I understand the key details? We might look at things like vocabulary or text structure and sometimes even think about the author's purpose. Again, our focus is on key details. Everybody say, key details. Good, I can tell you're listening. So again, do I understand the key details? Finally, we're going to dig really, really deep into this text. In phase three, we are going to go ahead and do a third read looking for evidence. This is where our teacher might give us a question that we might have to dig deep in the text to find the answer in the text. We are going to ask ourselves this question. Can I analyze the text and respond? We're going to have to find evidence in the text and pull it out to have some sort of answer or response. So again, we are going to go ahead and look at close reading, which involves three read. The first read is looking at the gist, breaking the surface. The second read goes a little deeper and focuses on the details. And the third read gets really deep in there, and we look at the evidence. Great job, students. Thanks for listening. And let's go ahead and start building our reading muscles with the next close read.